Warm Pacific greetings. Over 56 years ago, our Pacific leaders had the foresight to establish USPE as an institution of higher learning to educate current and future generations. We have since made a significant contribution to the advancement of women and gender equity across our region. Countless numbers of female graduates have made their mark as leaders in many fields, not just in their respective home countries, but internationally as well. In more recent times, more than 60% of all graduates have been female. I'm of course immensely proud of this achievement, but I also believe that gender should be equally reflected in all levels of our academic staff. Earlier this year, I established a strategic fund to mark International Women's Day and its theme, Invest in Women, Accelerate Progress. This fund is designed to support female academic staff who are on the threshold of promotion to take up to six months away from teaching in order to work on their research and publications. This important initiative is the first of its kind here at USP. I intend for it to be a transformative and important part of a multi-pronged strategy to accelerate progress in our ongoing commitment to advance gender equity across our university. After a competitive process, I'm delighted to congratulate and introduce you to the inaugural recipients of the award. My name is Purieta Etetofinga. I am of Kiribati and Tuvalu heritage. I wanted to pursue a career in this field as I believe there is a lack of Kiribati women representation in academia. Through the Women Tech Climate Resilience Project, we hope to understand how climate change impacts women's livelihoods. We will observe the role of traditional ecological knowledge in informing women's economic and social practices in the indigenous communities that are highly vulnerable to climate change. I'm passionate about this research as it will contribute insights to discussions on gender empowerment and the importance of traditional knowledge in the Pacific. The findings could also guide policy makers and businesses work closely with women in indigenous communities. My name is Dr. Amanda Ford and I'm a marine ecologist. My research focuses on coral reef ecology, marine management and marine pollution. Through my team's work, we strive to bridge the gap between scientific research and management, focusing on assisting local communities and future generations to conserve coastal marine ecosystems and their resources. I currently lead two multi-year projects here, comprising colleagues, students and external partners. One is a regional project in four Pacific Island countries, which aims to establish regional baselines for marine plastics in reef fish and to document local perceptions to plastic pollution. The second project aims to understand the drivers and impacts of benthic cyanobacterial mats on coral reefs in Fiji. Coastal marine ecosystems are vital for food security, coastal protection and income generation in Pacific Island countries, and yet they're being harmed by pollution, changing fishing methods and climate change. And this is why the research work that we do is so important. Mbulovinaka, my name is Hilda Wanga Sakiti. I'm working on a pilot project designed to measure the health and stability of Fiji's blue carbon ecosystems like mangroves and seagrass meadows. The project aims to create a reliable tool to assess and monitor the health of these ecosystems developed specifically for Fiji. In addition, I also lead the Pacific Ocean and Climate Crisis Assessment Project. This covers 16 Pacific countries and assesses how Pacific indigenous knowledge systems can coexist with Western scientific approaches in climate change adaptation and mitigation. The research data will help Pacific governments frame policies and be useful in global negotiations to promote the uniqueness of our Pacific voices and experiences. Congratulations once again to our inaugural recipients. I acknowledge and commend the hard work of all our female academics and researchers at USP as we continue to invest in women to accelerate their progress.